Hello friends, today I'm going to show you how to create a datum point and the datum coordinate system in PTC Creo Parametric 3. So you see that I have created a base plate here with a circle at the corner and a arc and an arc whose purpose you can see at the end of the video. So let's get started. Select point and select any vertex so by selecting any vertex you don't need to define any reference it will take the reference point at that vertex and hit ok so you see a point is created at this vertex similarly select point and select any edge so here you can see on the reference the edge is selected and in offset window you see at the ratio of 0.48 either you can position the point in the ratio terms or in the real number let's say the ratio is 0.5 this means that this point is at the center of this reference edge or in real value you can see the point is at the center of this edge that is the 200 millimeter and hit ok so similarly select the point and select this upper surface now you see these green handles or you can say them grips position them at the references and you see here the reference is the surface on which the point is placed and the offset references are two edges you can set the value let's say 100 and 100 here and select this on and you see an offset option here so offset means that the point is created at a certain offset distance from the selected surface let's say we hit value 50 and hit OK. So you see the point is created in the space that is the 50 millimeter offset from the selected surface. Similarly, select point and select this arc. Now select on and select its center. And you see the point 3 is known as the center of this arc and hit OK. So this is how you create the different type of datum points in PTC Creo Parametric. Similarly, you can create a datum point by offset coordinate system. For that, you need to show the coordinate display. Now, for reference, select the coordinate system and click on the name dialog box and you can set values here because we choose the type Cartesian you can set in cylindrical or spherical coordinates too so I'm going to create the first point at the center click on the second box and set the values say 5 10 and 10 and 15 and hit ok so you see the point datum point are these shown in green colors similarly there is third option in datum point that is the field the field point is not used in modeling purposes it is generally used for user defined features and it does not require any references it only require the surface to be positioned on and hit ok so you see a field point is created here highlighted in green color now move to the datum coordinate system so select the coordinate system and make sure to show all the planes now just like the datum plane or datum axis it requires two datums so select any plane so you see these drag handle refer it to this edge and this to the bottom edge now 
delete this select this plane and select this to position this and move this point to this and you see a datum coordinate system is created and hit you can change the value here let's say 10 and this value let's say 60 and hit ok so you see a new datum coordinate system is created so i hope you like this video thumbs up for this video and for more epic tutorials subscribe to my channel workal23 the link is in the description thank you i'll see you next